Joe Rogan. What's up, you little bitch? That cue ball on your dome piece. Wow, is that a sight? It's such a sight, it gave me a poem to write. I call this poem, You're So Bald. You're so bald. When you get stressed out, your head turns gray. You're so bald, Mr. Clean and Captain Picard are jealous with envy. So bald, I can polish your head and bowl that sucker. Because you're world's baldest, boisterous, bitch-ass motherfucker. Yo, you taste in clothes, my god, this guy looks like fucking Aladdin. I just want to wrap this dude in a magic carpet and feed his ass to the sharks. Yo, put some fucking real clothes on and do some real fucking work for a change. Now, I'm, I'm here to like, like I was deflating your balls, I'm here to deflate your ego. So check it out. Just because you were on a Netflix fucking movie or show, Lily Hammer, or whatever the fuck, doesn't make you a star. In fact, in America, trust me, no one gives a damn about little Steven either. Uh, half of us don't even know who the fuck that guy is. So stop putting out ads and taking advantage of poor people. And can you fucking just wipe your own ass for once? Shit. Shit. I mean, start giving back to the community and stop being a total douchebag. That's what this is about. You know, you drive a French convertible. That's got to be the dumbest shit I've ever heard. Is that shit bootleg or something? What the fuck, guy? Look, they call you Bear, but I'm going to call you Fuzzy Wuzzy. It's Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear. And Fuzzy Wuzzy had no hair. But Fuzzy Wuzzy wasn't Fuzzy Wuzzy born, you fucking motherfucking Neanderthal bald motherfucker. Ugh. So listen up, cute ball. Don't take this the wrong way. But it's tough love. Get your shit together and do what your boss fucking tells you to do. Bitch, 